yeah. as a closing. <laughs> okay. Um, there is a lot that you can do when you have a toddler, when you have a baby, a toddler, you have time there to prevent all what's coming later. You know, um, I would say connection, connection, spending time with the child, talking, having conversation, being mindful about uh, the emotional stages or mental states that mm. the kid has. Don't leave them alone in their emotions. Mm. You know, even when they are throwing a tantrum, most parents take distance or send them to the room or they walk away. They cannot, they cannot be there. They, th they don't think that it's important for them to be there because the kid is lost in his, his or her feelings. Mm. So if you sit down, the baby's throwing a tantrum, you sit down next to, to him or to her and say, I'm here, I know you're having a hard time. Um, you're so mad, but I'm here. I'm not gonna leave you alone with this. With these so they don't feelings. seek refuge in other things, mm -hmm. like social media and drugs, if, if anything. Yeah, they need connection. Okay. A kid cannot survive without, without that, with a, without a parent monitoring, being aware of what's going on, right? Yeah. So if you talk to them, if you interact with them, if you, did, if you do this um, presence cure, you know, yeah. there is actually a technique that they started to use. Um, Presence cure. Yeah. When you see something is going wrong, you right away fix it by being present, Be for, present. For, for a long time. You mm. make time, you put everything on the side, you are there with the child. Nice. You know? that, that helps a lot. Um, I don't know if I can give one more example. Do we have time? We only have one minute. Actually, okay. we have already passed the time. Passed the time. But I think it's important. We don't want to miss that one, do we? <laughs> one last one, very shortly.